Nurkic set the pick for Allen. Another three for Phoenix. I mean, can we say he was playing possum a bit there in the first half because he seems to be a different guy out there, way more assertive. It's three outside. Rebounded by Allen. And they've controlled the glass throughout this game, but it's still close. Jones, no one around him. A basket good off the assist from Allen. Allen's got his eighth assist in the game. And we've got a timeout called by Steve Kerr. And that timeout by Coach was carefully measured, wanting to make sure that everybody is on the same page here. He's checked in for Tyus Jones. Heels checked in for Golden State. Richardson comes in for Curry. And now we've got some time to check in from the sidelines. You got for us, DA? Hey, guys. Well, Steve Kerr talked to his team during the last time out. Now, he was quite encouraging in the huddle. He said, look, you're fighting out there, fellas. I can see it. I need you to keep giving everything you have. Bring this one home. See if they can pull it off. Guys? Thank you, David. And here's Booker following the three-pointer by Buddy Heal. Yeah, not a fan of that one, guys. If he wants to help his team cut into this deficit, he should not be attempting those kind of shots. Now, here's Richardson. Curry outside. Another three for Golden State. No way he's going to pass that shot up. The D is way too far back and relaxed in getting out on it. No good from Booker. And here's Heal. He'll bring it up for the Golden State Warriors. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. And this is what dominating the glass looks like. He just cannot be contained. Sort of reminding me of a little Ben Wallace action here from his years with the Pistons. He's been that much of a force rebounding the ball. Well, the fact that he has that many rebounds for a guy of his size and stature shows you he truly cares about grabbing possessions off the rim. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Curry. Suns trail by eight. Booker outside. Allen left side. Nice ball movement by Phoenix. And there's Booker on the assist by Durant. Booker's got 16 points here in the second half. Fires from way outside, and the Warriors get it back. Yeah, just nice hustle there. That work gets them the extra possession. Durant, the pass to Beal. Good! And he is brought them to within two points. <laughs> the nerves on this guy. <laughs> Not backing down from this moment here. When the game is close, he kicks it up enough. Now, here's Curry. Curry with another miss. Uh, sometimes you just have an off night, guys, and that's what we've seen so far. And how smart just get the ball to KD and get out of the way. There's 39 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Back to Curry. Three-pointer. Knocks down the three. He's a guy that lives for a big moment like that. Great focus and courage in the clutch. And Mike Budenholzer is called a timeout. The magnitude at this juncture in the game clearly warranting a timeout. And Any ideas on strategy being discussed right now in that huddle? And usually you want to go for the two for one here to maximize the clock. Now eight seconds separate in the two clocks. Here's Green, and stolen by Booker. Heal with it, guarded by Heald. That's why Devin Booker has the ball for moments just like that. Stolen by Durant. Booker against Kerr. Kicks it out to Allen. And they go to the intentional foul. Really no idea why you're fouling in a situation like that. You know, maybe there's some bad blood between those two. And Mike Budenholzer has called a timeout. And he knows there's no room for mistakes and wants everyone on the same page. 
So I'm looking at the clock, and guys, the situation. What do you think we're going to see next? Yeah, always intriguing to see what a coach draws up in this situation. And sometimes not just what a coach draws up, but who he has execute in these moments. And now they're trying to foul intentionally. Richardson, third personal foul, third team foul. He knocks down the clutch free throw. And so both free throws good that time. Yeah, not the guy that you want to put at the line in these moments. He's not missing these. And we've got a timeout called by Steve Kerr. No doubt he is feeling the importance of this moment right now. Well, given the scenario here, how do you approach this next possession? Well, always intriguing to see what a coach draws up in this situation. And sometimes not just what a coach draws up, but who he has execute in these moments. Here's Curry with the three. Off target from downtown. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. You have to foul, but I'm sure they would have liked to foul someone different. The second one is good. In both at the line, and it's a three-point game. That last one was a difference maker. It pushed it from a two-point lead to three. And so it's Phoenix who's straight by with 